Hello everyone, it's Sarah and Chris Waffle, Nerds in Oregon, here to take you on a new culinary adventure with us to the top of the Mandarin Oriental in Tokyo, the molecular, Tapas Molecular Bar. This was the view where we had the world's most expensive Moscow mule. 14 courses of deliciousness. Yes, and it's all molecular gastronomy. Everything was magnificent, including the bathroom. I am the person that took a picture in there. No one else was in there because I had to show everyone that you can see as far as possible from both sides of the hotel. Wave hello to Sky Tree. Tonight we have for you some videos, some pictures. Chef Ping, the head chef, and the chef that was working with him that night uh, encouraged us to take both. So here is the hot towel. You pour hot water on that little capsule and a towel grows. Then you open up the toolbox where you have all of the utensils. Chef will tell you which ones to use with each course. And the menu is written on the tape measure. So course number one, was salmon row and row. Only two of these were actually row and the other one was um, ponzu sauce that was gastronomized, I'll say. And then course number two, sog paneer. This was one of my favorite things we did that night. You took the syringe, it had foie gras and spinach in it. Then you had a rice puff. So you injected the rice puff with that. And chef said to take it in one bite. <laughs> One bite. Course number three was the dynamite roll. This was your favorite course of the night, a little bit of sushi. You can see here the team plating it. It was really interesting to be able to watch them plate everything with such precision. Yum. Then we move on to course number four, the blizzard. This is a Hokkaido scallop, and those are sea grapes and these uh, micro tomatoes that are actually fully grown. And then what they do is they look at them plate like that. That's crazy. I could have watched that all night long. Yeah, super cool to be right there watching the, the masters at work. Chef Ping is from Hong Kong, and he's worked for a Mandarin Oriental all over the world, Europe, um, some other places in Asia. Great food background. Really interesting. Next, they had taken the vinaigrette. It's like snow blizzards. Yeah. Wow. Oh. Look at that. Ah. There's a little liquid nitrogen. You're so, can you get it? and they froze it in um, dry ice, high, liquid nitrogen, and then it represented the snow. Course number five, the Benedict. This was lobster brioche and hollandaise sauce. I don't need to say anything else, it was delicious. It was awesome. And then course number six, the mushroomed egg. This was one of the neatest uses of molecular gastronomy because it was actually not an egg at all. And you're going to be surprised when you see the next video here. It's barley, truffle, broth, and I think he said soy sauce that he had made to appear like and feel like an egg. You taste it with the risotto, the mushroom, and the yolk. All together. Ready? <laughs> you gotta try this. Course number seven, fish munier. Sure, Chris. With this one, we actually had to grind up our own seasoning blend, which was kind of fun. Um, you got to get it as coarse or as, or as fine as you wanted. Then he delivered the plate and watched the magic. Oh! Moving on to course number eight, Peking Duck. Yes, Peking Duck was amazing. It had bean curd skin, cucumber, spring onion, and you really got to watch them 
just kind of charred the outside, which gave it such a um, a unique umami flavor. Really, you got that kind of that toasty flavor. Course number nine, Autumn Ranch. This is lamb and sprout, and they smoke it over hay. Chef will explain. Course 10, Confused Wagyu? This is A4 Wagyu beef, and it was really interesting. It's You thought it was the best thing you had really ever eaten. It was cooked sous vide. So good. Um, one thing I'll say, at this point in the meal, we realized exactly how much food we were going to eat. <laughs> Getting pretty full, but I wasn't too full for that beef. Wow. <laughs> Course 11, moving on, was Mushroom. Chef explains this one just fine with us. So, this is a dessert called Mushroom. Mushroom. It is made of mushroom. The cap of the mushroom is porcini. It's a marshmallow made of porcini. Mushroom. The stem is ice cream of truffle. So, porcini and truffle. Okay. And then this white stone, it's tapioca. Tapioca powder with some trouble oil, the shape is like a small stone, with some green tea cookie powder and chopped crumbs. Frozen chestnut, chestnut cream, frozen. And then some hot chocolate. Wow. Wow. Course 12, the Very Berry Chai. This one is fun because it was almost like a reverse lava cake. Instead of cooking the outside partially, they put it again in the liquid nitrogen. Yeah, there were pop rocks in it, so you could just feel it pop in your mouth. And then course 13 was Pina Colada. We had had the wine courses. I hardly remember this. It was good. <laughs> and then course 14, the After 8. The most interactive of all courses. Watch the magic. It's cocoa and mint that's been uh, frozen again in liquid nitrogen. Behold. You are really better at it. Deep breath. <laughs> well, Sarah, we had a great time. Uh, best everything, meal, best meal of my life. Everything right? was delicious. Uh, comment below on what you thought looked the best. Everything was awesome. They do a seasonal menu there, so it's going to change every season. Um, and they encourage you to interact, take videos and photo, and you'll have a great time. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And if you're in Tokyo, check it out if you can.